Jones. And today we got a first-hand look at some of the ongoing preparations for this summer's America's Cup World Series in Newport. Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Estefan is in our newsroom with details that are new at 5. Millions of dollars are going into the upgrade. We were there and got a look at the work in progress. Joe Dias, chief of Newport's economic development, leads a crowd through some ongoing changes to Fort Adams in Newport. All of this so the island can play host to a big race, the America's Cup. This is very exciting. From electrical to structural changes, even some new docks, the nearly $4 million project will open these waterways to some racing nostalgia. The, I think the America's Cup left in maybe 83, and this is the first time it's, uh, there's been any kind of cup racing back here since then. The money will come from Rhode Island Capital Funds. Dias tells us the changes will serve a greater purpose long after the America's Cup is gone. Uh, the electric and water upgrades to the to the dock in the sailing center area, most regattas that you have around the world require that uh, in order to stage a race. And All of this construction must be complete by the time the first boat arrives in Newport. Just about three months left. Organizers tell us nothing will stand in the way. All of the crew that's been working on this for the last year is all ready to go. Due to the updates to Fort Adams, Newport has already secured two more regattas in the coming year. In the newsroom, Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.